Hello from Cape Breton. We're Davy and Sky. We're gonna be having a little winter weekend here. We're starting our day off at Ski Ben Yacht. This is where I learned how to ski since I was like this big to, well, I didn't grow that much, I guess. <laughs> so I'm excited to be back. This is like maybe my fourth, maybe my fifth time skiing. So I'm getting better each time. It's still terrifying. Instructor but... Skylar is here. <laughs> Skylar's a good teacher. Do, do, like... do, do. Oh, don't forget your goggles. Did you get your goggles? Yes, you got them. Back. You don't need to wear them in there. What? I can't see without my goggles. Okay, now load the bus. Oh, oh yeah. Oh yeah. Big smiles. Ready to go? Pizza, pizza, pizza. Come on. Are you okay? Triple whammy, let's go. <laughs> hey, what do you cut wood with? A saw, dude. Oh. <laughs> is that what it is? Yeah. A oh, saw, dude. <laughs> oh, this is extreme sports here. Wow. Look at this guy, he's about to go. He's going. Oh, yeah. Wow. Look at the view. 10 out of 10 view. A little bit of info about Ski Banyan. I actually didn't look any of this up, so it's just kind of all on the top of my head. But Ski Banyan is definitely a staple here on Cape Breton Island. It's been here for decades and decades, and there is a big loyalty to it. So you get lots of regulars, but then also lots of wintercationers that come here to experience the hill. Uh, they have a fantastic staff down at the uh, rental and lodge area. And then on the hill itself, there are 11 different runs for you to experience. There's a bunny hill as well for you to learn. And there is cross-country skiing trails as well as snowshoeing trails too. I believe you can rent all of that equipment for cross-country and snowshoeing down at the uh, gear shop. We are starting on the far left side. We're going to do the timber doodle. Yeah. <laughs> I like this type of, type of hill. I could do this all day. Yeah, I think <laughs> that we definitely probably should have started you with Benyon, but instead David learned on Ski Cape Smoky, which has like the highest alpine something in Atlantic Atlantic, Canada yeah. or something I can't remember and then we jumped to Marble Mountain in Newfoundland last year which was definitely jumping straight into the fire so um, I really like Benyon this is again where I learned to, uh, to ski so I think that you're gonna enjoy today a lot accidentally sent David down a steeper hill than I had planned to for his first go again uh. <laughs> <laughs> that was a lot steeper than I thought it was going to be. That was very be. steep. <laughs> that was scary. You did so well though. You did so well. Let's keep going. I'm back again. Yeah, you look really cool. <laughs> In your Italian uh, snowsuit. It's from Roma. <laughs> Working on the Rome videos. The, Itali the Italy videos are coming. I'm just They're taking some time. Find out where we got the snowsuit. currently on the Groovy Goose Run. It's my favorite one. It's not too difficult, nice and easy. Skylar is gonna dance and ski backwards. No, I'm not skiing backwards. Down this beautiful view. No. Hit it. He's crushing it. I'm so proud. So proud. What a face going on here. That looks really good. Yeah. After a long day of skiing. <laughs> I've always wanted to do that. Last round of the day. Let's go. Woo! 
All right, go, go, go. <laughs> Last run of the day. Let's go. Do a woo. Video? Woo. That's not a woo. Hello from Cabot Shores Wilderness Resort. Checked in here late last night, which is after our final run at the ski hill. And uh, got the dogs here, star friendly. Give you a little tour, we're in the tiny house. There's one big room, full kitchen here. They even have a burner and a fridge and a microwave and dishes and everything. So this is our tiny house. Have a cozy couch here. And a very comfortable bed that we already slept in last night. We have bathroom little, down there, so we have a shower. A little table right here as well. And then our own private deck with a hot tub. We really enjoyed the hot tub last night. We kind of just sat out and it was sprinkling rain a bit. <laughs> oh, Toby wants to say hi. Um, and then, yeah, we might jump back in again today because it's snowing. It's a beautiful winter day out and we're just happy to be here. Yeah, this is a great place. Uh, they have a little breakfast spread every morning. Went and had some breakfast, and uh, yeah, there's like a bunch of domes, yurts. Lots uh, of a unique accommodations, yeah. and they have a very eco-friendly aspect here too, and the owners are lovely. Yeah. They have hiking trails. There were some people that mentioned about doing a polar dip in the river, because they also have a sauna and a hot tub down by the river too, so you can do a little hot, cold, heat hydrotherapy. I think every, almost every spot you can stay here has a hot tub and pretty much everything is dog friendly too are you an alcoholic toby a pup light <laughs> not a bud light a pup light it is a freezing today i'm gonna get in the hot tub oh you're Ow, warm my foot sorry Ow. you're warm oh my gosh uh, that's actually hot it's hotter than yesterday Very nice. Oh, that was like no one. Yeah, you gotta stop it. What are you doing? <laughs> oh, you get sucked in. <laughs> My pop got sucked in. Oh, good soup. <laughs> oh, are you trying the soup too? We're heading home. Just a quick little video. We did Ski Banyan and Cabot Shores. Make sure to check them out. We also Same shared about so. them on social media. So if you're not already following us on Instagram or Facebook, yeah. we're Davy and Sky on everything. And yeah, thanks for watching. We just love featuring spots that we go. Even if it's not a big, long, detailed video, we hopefully inspire you to check out these spots because they are incredible and they're right here on Cape Breton Island. Happy winter adventuring. Bye. Bye. <laughs>